Logging arrivals. Shan Margo. Welcome to Frozen Hell. Population 10. 11 counting Gaia. Don't count your chicken embryos before they incubate it, hon. She's still firing up. Be a while before you eat that omelet. Vegan Travis, you think we'd worked in the same secret base long enough for you to notice? We weren't scheduled to shack up here for another three weeks. You realize I just lost 350 kilos of pre-code smut comics in transit. <laughs> Wait, actual physical media? Why didn't you have it digitized? Can't beat the feel of physical media on your fingers. And in here, we ain't gonna be touching a whole lot else. Figured I was gonna pass the time archiving them. What about you? Me? At work, I guess. My task queue stretches out for, like, three years. There's a lot of sharp edges to round off. After that, I hadn't really thought about it. Oh, you will. you what, 30? Rick, can you be the one turning the lights off at the end? Food for thought, huh, vegan? This sucks forever. That'll be the no, way back. Not forever. Just the rest of your life. That's kind of forever. <laughs> not forever, just the rest of your life. Uh... I'm hearing things that sound like lasers. This way. Yep. This went around a little bit this way as well. That goes nowhere there. like this for 19 years, right? Well... D don't answer. I think his answer would be it looked much better back then. Definitely worse for wear now. Oh, glad that's over. Is that the way I need to go? That's where I came from. I feel like that's the way they want me to go. Not 
This way. Yeah. Maybe further up the shaft. I had to check. That looks like a bed. Definitely looks like where people lived. Record. I just woke up. It's. I see the numbers, but can't make up the time. I was dreaming of. Uh, I was giving a lecture in Q Hall. Maybe it was something more shamanistic. I, I don't know. An audience of shadowy faces under a blank open sky. I told them the world ended with a bang. A plague of robots. But the last humans. We went out, not with a whimper, but a whisper. You know, in caves, ending like we started, huddled around a flickering glow. The heads of state, the Fortune Fives, the leaders, and lottery winners, and life cults, all of them buried in their little shelters some believing they'll live it out some way somehow or elysium or us here at kaya prime no different a multitude of tiny societies taking hold flaring dying some will be beautiful some horrific none of that matter short-term civilizations one last gasp one last gasp for the long-held breath. Before I wake up, I know the audience is gone. I'm talking to myself, to a quiet planet, a barren sphere. Just Gaia and her long, long dreaming. I hope she won't be lonely. Another bedroom. Evacuation happens so fast. No time to think things through. No time for goodbyes. There were lines in the medical ward. I told Tom Paik I'd be with him when he went under. But there was one last shipment of parody Sadie Zygos I could get processed if I rushed. I'm still angry at him for forcing me to choose. Angry at myself for... Well, he died alone. And I didn't get the bloody birds of paradise saved either. Damn. All the time left in the world now to think. Gaia Prime's locks are sealed. Elysium sealed up, safe and sound. A distance of miles, but it might as well be on the other side of the galaxy. All the beaters and gammas and support staff living their lives. If I hadn't been an alpha, if things had gone differently, I could have been there. Instead, I'm spending the rest of my unnatural life in here with people I don't even like. And without the one, I would have gladly spent my life with. Given a chance. Two hours since I signed off Damn. on the final executables and I'm already a bitter old man bitching to his focus. There's a thought for future generations. Well, we know they died out. We don't know how long they lasted. 
after being trapped down here. When I'm spinning, I'm just checking to checking the bar at the top of the map above Aloy's head to see if there's any boxes for any logs to scan. Elizabeth's room. I know it. She didn't even get a chance to unpack. These are her journals. Elizabeth's journals. And they're all destroyed. Scan them. The focus can rebuild them, but the process is slow. File damaged under repair. File damaged under repair. Same, same, and same. Only four more quest starter points to go. Uh-oh. Have I missed another one? To us it seems a powerful device, but its engine is tiny and limited. How slow? Days, weeks, years. Concern yourself with stopping Hades and extending the future, and you might live long enough to hear them. This one was... There was one here, wasn't there? Yep. There. Charles Ronson. Which was that one? Margot Shen was found before but shows later in the log. This room I didn't find one in. Margot Shen I found in here. So, Margot Shen's in there, and the other one was in there. Nothing found in that room, or up there. Where could that other one be? There's that little room there that I couldn't, didn't see anything. Is that here? Yeah. Okay. So I did go in there. Pretty sure I have the list of... Audio, audio data points, I 
It is towards the end. Why don't they have numbers? Make it easier to find them. So the one I'm missing is the Charles Ronson one. There's two Charles Ronson Ronsons in a row. Is that one looks like it might be further in? Because the map does look different. Okay, it's found on this floor. I don't know if I've been on this floor yet. I don't think so. So I've been there. And I think that must be where I came in. So I have been on this floor, but not... ...in the spot where it is. walkthrough I've got doesn't say precise exactly where it is but it says enough that I can work it out This is the room. I think it's that right there. Maybe? It does look like it's that. Maybe it's not active until I do this? Which doesn't really make too much this sense. This is Charles Ronson. Or it could be this. 
I'm logging this six hours after final deployment of Gaia Prime. This morning, an access port seal malfunctioned. Gaia Prime's port seals were designed to close with a seam of less than two millimeters. But this one closed with a 10 millimeter gap. Enough for an energy signature to bleed through. Enough for the swarm to detect this facility. Oh. Enough for Gaia to be discovered and destroyed. Enough to end the future we worked so hard to make possible. Unless the hatch servos were manually re-engaged from the outside. Damn. I'm now switching to a recording of the event. Well, I'm not going out there. Now who I signed up for? Either we sent someone out or all of this was for nothing. It should be Liz's decision. So when is she going to get here? She said five minutes. You don't think... Oh no. Okay, everyone. I've repaired the seal. Got oh. It. Seal closure at 1.4 millimeters. Confirmed. Elizabeth, no. We'll find a way to bring you back in. It's not gonna happen. The swarm's too close. Really. It's all right. Guy's complete. She'll take care of things. There's a hologram of her. Not like this. There's so much we... Guys, you know me. I'm... I'm no good at endings. At letting things end, so, um... Let's not. So... Happy trails, Liz. And, uh... See you around. Yeah. Take care of each other, all right? Liz. I'm okay with this. She sacrificed herself to save everyone else. That was the last transmission of Elizabeth Sobek. She gave everything for the hope of life on this planet. And we are all in her debt. That's not the one. That was that point there. Ah, there we go. You'd hate it, Liz, but I wrote you a eulogy. I had to try to express all your children. After all Apollo has taught them, they'll think they know everything. But they have to understand what you did for no. them. How you love the whole world so much. With they an don't know of any, any of it. Dazzling. Bruising. And in the end, it killed you. Or you died for it. Different perspectives. No one could keep up with you, live up to you. I, I don't know, maybe if, if, I, if I hadn't taken that postdoc in Joburg, I'm glad you shot down the Lightkeeper protocol in the end. I don't think I could have taken seeing another one of you. I mean... Elizabeth Sobek... <laughs> ...is only one. I miss you. And yet there is Aloy. Yep, there it is. Why couldn't I see that before seeing the other vision? Look, Liz. You were a pretty stand-up gal. I'm sorry you died. If you had a home to go to, I hope you got there first. But this monument Ronson's made to you? Kinda creepy if you ask me. Rest in peace, Liz. God knows you earned it. Why did it skip more? Hell, Liz. I know. I know you're never going to hear this. 
exists. That's not the point. You, uh... <laughs> you got to play the savior in the motor all at once this time. Great work. Why can't these just be in order of where they are in the story? Now it looks like I've missed two more. There's only seven left in the whole storyline. Aloy? She's gone. Obviously. Oh you knew she couldn't have survived, Eloy. Yeah. And her achievements were beyond exceptional. While her people bickered, she was the one. But then, earlier in the story, Silence did try to give Aloy help, uh, hope by saying who knows what new technology advancements they made and who knows how long... Elizabeth Sobeck could have lived for and that she may still be alive. And now he's saying we all knew that that was never a possibility. He's all over the place. I took responsibility. The only one who could. She was better than them. That's not what I said. She was. You shouldn't be afraid to admit it. Not in the way you mean. You think she was better because she was smart. Because she designed Zero Dawn, but you missed the point. What made her great was that she was willing to sacrifice herself for others, for everyone who would come later. No. She couldn't let her creation fail. You're confusing will for sentimentality. You're wrong. Remember, she knew it wasn't enough for Gaia to think. She taught Gaia to yep. feel, to care, to sacrifice, to believe in life, enough to fight against hopelessness. If it wasn't for that sentimentality, life would have ended. You and I would never have existed. Your argument is sound. I'm sorry for your loss. She said she wanted to go home. Maybe. What? Nothing. It's time to go on. Aloy wants to find where she lived. I'm almost certain of it. Knowing this game, this is probably the way they want me to go. And this looks like a way up. Hello, Margo. How are you holding up? Um, Dr. Ronson, I've been getting a lot of messages, unsolicited messages from Ted. Oh. Margo, I'm sorry. With Liz gone, we've got no one to run interference with him. <laughs> I'll talk to Ted. He mostly wants updates, constant updates, hundreds of updates on things he knows nothing about. Liz used to field all of his crap. Why he does that not surprise the me? At all. I was kind of by design, but he's getting <laughs> pretty sketchy with me. We just have to keep him happy. Liz always said, keep him happy. Are you kidding? You ever hear how she talked to him? <laughs> she was managing him, Margo. I mean, maybe I should ignore him. He's buried in his pyramid with the Hola Hola girls and Panta Antimon Cuckoos. What can he do? Which one was that? Another one further in. Ah. <sighs>
I can always come back to here and unless a door shuts behind me or I have to go down, so. What are we gonna plug into their heads, Les? A whole lot of history? A whole lot of so-called truth? A whole, a whole lot of noise? It's not pablum, Les. It's poison. Uh... It's poison to te teach him things. Well, there's one of them. Good. Just looking at the thing again. Okay, I'll go down here. The next one is in the next spot here. No, I can't go down. Or is down up. Down is up. So climbing up goes down a level here. Makes total sense, doesn't it? 